Hi friends, welcome to Upper Studies YouTube channel. This is part 3 in Python in PySpark real time scenarios playlist. In this video, we are going to discuss about how we can convert PySpark data frame to Pandas data frame. So, before starting this video, I would encourage you to watch my PySpark playlist to understand more about PySpark. So, let's jump into this video. So, there is a function called two pandas on top of a data frame object that will help you to convert PySpark data frame into pandas data frame actually. So now you may be thinking what is pandas. So this video intention is not to explain about pandas actually. I will try to create a complete playlist of pandas if possible in future. So for now think like pandas is a open source python library like it's like a package which has lot of functionalities in it. Using that data analyst or data scientist people can do lot of data processing data cleaning and many other things they can do it so if you want to work with data and uh, maybe you want to transform it maybe you want to clean it maybe you want to query it so when you are working with large amount of data sets you will feel a need of pandas library also so why because it gives you easy capability very useful functions in it that will help you to perform big big data transformations very easily actually so that's the reason many data engineers or data analysts or data scientist people they will try to add this skill set also into their resumes so they will try to expert themselves in the pandas as well so it is also python only but a package readymately available for you to work with data okay so for now you can have that idea about pandas so now when you want to apply some kind of pandas related functions on top of data first you need to take the data into pandas data frame actually but sometimes in your projects you might have created a data frame using pyspark so now at that cases you will get a need of converting that pyspark data frame into pandas data frame so it is very straightforward actually as i said to pandas function let me practically show you that so let's go to browser so this is my databricks workspace and here let me go to workspace users under my name let's try to create a new notebook here so let me right click here to create a new notebook here one second so let me right click create notebook and let me name this maybe two pandas two pandas notebook okay so python is a default language cluster i am attaching it let me hit create button to create this notebook so let me close this tooltip here i mean the pop-up here and here let's try to create a data frame first so if you have seen my pyspark playlist you know how to create a data frame with hard coded values so i am creating a variable called data which holds a list of tuples so let's have a tuples like this maybe two rows so this every tuple represents one row in a data frame actually so i'm adding id name and then maybe gender and then maybe salary okay similarly row number two name is wafa then male gender then salary maybe three thousand okay so now let's try to create a another variable maybe with the name of like schema which holds list of column names so we have id column we want to have column name as name we want to have column name as gender and finally we want to have a column name as salary so spark keyword in pyspark will give you pyspark session i mean spark session object so on top of it we have this create data frame function so how the intelligence is coming when i press control space you will get an intelligence after that so to this data frame i mean to this function i am passing data and schema variables what i created and this entire code will actually create a data frame so let me store that data frame into a variable called df now here let's try to do one thing let's try to show this data frame and also let's try to print type of this data frame type function will give you type of this variable so let me hit shift enter to execute this command and let's wait for the command execution to complete here command executed successfully i can see my data frame also if you see the type of my data frame is pyspark dot sql dot data frame dot data frame type that means it is a data frame object of 
PySpark type. Okay, it's not a pandas type. So now, as I said, if I want to convert this data frame into pandas data frame, what I can do? On top of this data frame object, you have something called two pandas function. Okay. So let me try to type two pandas function. So if you want to know the documentation of this function, use this help function first. So let me use help and shift enter to run this command and let's wait for the command to execute here. And if you see the documentation of this, it says it is a method and uh, it says like uh, this will return a content in a pandas data frame format and also it has examples also so if you have a data frame you can apply this to pandas to convert the data frame into pandas data frame and when you display that pandas data frame or when you print the pandas data frame you will also get this sequence number for every row so for example if you see the preview here we don't have any sequence number we have id column name column gender salary but there is no sequence number but when you print pandas data frame you get a sequence number also let me practically show you that so let me remove this code here so here we created a data frame normal PySpark data frame so on top of that let's try to apply this to pandas function and whatever the data frame it creates let me try to save that in a variable called df underscore pandas so that means pandas data frame okay so now on top of df underscore pandas if i try to use the show function it won't work why because this data frame is not PySpark data frame the show function will be available on a PySpark data frame objects only. For pandas data frame object, show function will not work because it is not available there. So let me hit shift enter and show you that error also here. So code is running here. So this line executed, that means we created a pandas data frame. But here it says a error. Why? Because this data frame object, which is pandas data frame type, don't have this attribute called show. Okay. So how to show this uh, data frame then? Then what you can do, you can use this display function. So let me use display function to the display function. Let me pass pandas data frame and let me hit shift enter. So using display function, you can display it or you should, you can directly use a print also. So to the print function, pass your pandas data frame, you will get data back. So let me hit shift enter to execute this. Now, if you see, I am able to print my data frame also along with the data. And as I said, this row number sequence will come in a pandas data frame so to make you sense that way to make you real sense like it is a pandas data frame only so let me use this type function also on top of my data frame and see so let me hit shift enter we can see this data frame is pandas type okay so now now you may be doubting if i use this print function on top of my normal PySpark data frame will it work it will work but it won't show the data as like this it will simply give list of column names let me show you that so let me remove this here and let me use print print of my data frame simply and let me hit shift enter to execute this cell now and now if you observe this print statement actually gives you this data it won't actually print the data frame so this data frame got printed because of this line of code here okay so that's it so like this using this two pandas function you can convert a PySpark data frame into pandas data frame actually so let's go back to presentation so i hope you got an idea how to do this how to convert a PySpark data frame to pandas data frame thank you for watching please subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon to get the notifications whenever i add videos thank you so much